Hey guys, welcome back to the video. So today I'll be showing you how to increase FPS in Cilda's Vibrant Shaders. Most of you guys may be using Optifine and here I'm using Sodium mode with Iris. But it doesn't matter because each and every setting I'm changing here also can be changed in Optifine. Before starting this video, make sure to subscribe to Maxkeep and hit that bell icon so you can receive a notification when I upload a new video. And also there are a lot of cool stuff to check out in my channel. So make sure to check them out too. Alright, so let's start by going to options, video settings, then change the render distance to 6 and the simulation distance to 6. Then turn off vSync and keep the max frame rate to unlimited. Then hit apply. Now go to shader pack settings and open Cilda's vibrant shader settings. First go to anti-aliasing and turn off TAA and hit apply. Go to bloom settings and turn off bloom. Now open shadows and reduce the shadow resolution to medium. Alright now let's check the FPS. Now you can see my FPS is pretty stable. These settings are perfect if you just want to increase little amount of FPS without losing visual quality. But still if your FPS is running low and if you don't mind to reduce quality, follow these settings with me. Again go to the video settings and shader back settings. Go to sky and lighting and turn off god rays. Then go to shading settings. Turn off ambient occlusion, hit apply. As you can see now my FPS is way higher than before, also it gives me a smoother gameplay. So by using these settings I hope you guys can run Silda's Vibrant Shaders without any trouble. And that's the end of this video. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye bye.